Cheers! <laughs> You're gonna drink the cocktail and pedal straight away. Like. I couldn't believe that, yeah. Good morning everyone, I am now in the Atlantis Hotel, if you can see it on the right side there. I got invited for a private corona party on Messimi Beach. We're gonna have the cocktail masterclass and some uh, paddle boarding classes as well, so I think it will be a fun day. Welcome. Hey, nice to meet you. Hi. Thank you. Hey, Jack. I assume you will be the, with the board today. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna start now, so let's go. How do you spell your name? Just make it Shark, it's easy, it's like, don't worry about it. Okay. So guys, uh, please meet Shark. Uh, he works for Strop House Dubai and today he will show you how to stand on the paddle board properly. Okay, hello guys. When we start with paddle boarding, you first of all want to make sure that your paddle is on the right length and that you hold it on the right way. So the right length for paddle boarding would be that the paddle is about two thirds between the wrist and the elbow. Well, this paddle is already quite long because you're a little bit shorter. So, I'm a tall girl. <laughs> exactly, so you all manage. And you always want to make sure that the, most pedals have a logo, but at least that the pedal angle mm -hmm. is facing forward. And then when you want to enter the board like from one side to the other, it doesn't really matter. We always start on our knees. So when we get onto our boards, just make sure that the handle is nice between your knees so we can get started. Can I just pedal? So when we pedal, we just bring the pedal out to the front and we pull ourselves towards the pedal so in this case. After a few strokes, you just have a little bit of speed, make sure you get up, put your pedal down, hands over the pedal so you don't lose it. One foot up, the other one up, and then we stand up and we pedal straight away. It's very important when we stand that we keep our knees slightly bent so we can adjust if there is a little wave or anything like that and that we focus on a straight back. Straight arms, same thing, we pull ourselves forward so the board glides towards the pedal instead of the other way around. Do you have any questions? Guys, I finished my paddle boarding session. I haven't done it for quite a long time, but the sun is so strong and I got the sun burned, so I decided to stop. And I can see that a guy started preparing breakfast for us, so let's go there. It'll be a good challenge to actually do that on the raft that we're gonna build, but you're gonna drink the cocktail and pedal straight away, like, see you can stay on board. You're in, you're in, right? Of course you do, challenge yourself, come on. I'm participating now in raft challenge, there are two teams and this is my team. It's pretty tough and this is my first time. It's just like very interesting, both of like a complete different approach of building. There is another challenge. You need to take your raft and go to that guy on the surfboard and fill out the basket from Corona. The team who does it first wins the challenge. So guys, our team won! Dennis has an experience as bartender and now he's gonna show you a trick with Corona beer. So guys, do you know why Corona has a piece of lime on the top? Uh, there were a lot of flies in Mexico and people found a solution. They started to use a piece of lime as a cork. So when they're not drinking, they just put a uh, lime and the flies cannot get into your drink. And now it became a worldwide tradition, so every bar serves Corona with a piece of lime. Cheers! Yeah. 
now it's time to learn how to make cocktails and there is a guy small bar we see the crowd here everyone is ready so guys a little bit about uh, corona right it, it uses the four main beer ingredients water malt hops and yeast So guys, now it's my time to practice how to make cocktails. Okay, so. Glass. <laughs> Glass. Gin. Gin. Four, you count to, Three. Count to six. Six. All right, so one, two. Yeah, that's the same Oh, no, just hold it. So it's very simply. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, Yeah, like five, I started six. it when I was eight. Okay. Gonna put that, slide it in the top. Yeah, and then, and then you just put that there. Thank you very much. Cheers. <laughs> So guys, our small party has come to the end and if you would like to attend our next event Casa Playa on the Simi Beach on the 27th and 28th of September, don't forget to book these days into your calendar so you won't miss it out and I will see you there. Bye bye.